I'm trying to move. Oh, it's supposed to use the assist. I forgot about this shit. <laughs> wow, this is just this is crazy. You know, I read an article like a couple weeks ago that talked about how this actually is like one of the greatest Easter eggs of all time in any video game. And they weren't exaggerating. This is like really big. Like I said, I haven't played this game since like back on Game Boy, man. It's way back when I was like five, six years old. Oh shit. I'm trying to do this a little bit better than I did the first. Oh, never mind. Well, that blows. I'm gonna try and do this a little bit better than I did the first time earlier on in the game. Man, I think it was like part five when I played this, as a matter of fact. I don't even know how many, because, you know, I'm just still playing. I don't even know how many videos it's gonna, this entire series is gonna be closing it out. What? No fucking way. Oh my god, it's my last life. I misjudged that jump. Concentrating, guys. Concentrating. Oh, that's a wrap. Epilogue. Tell me I'm not playing as who I think we're playing as. Mom? Dad? No fucking way. Dad? Yo, they had a kid. This place is a huge mess. They got a kid. I think I said that earlier on. Too. I said it was inevitable, but I didn't actually think they were going to put it in this game. I think they abandoned us. Got a nice little dog. Let's see what you got. This place has had an upgrade, though. I will say that. Mom has weird taste in music, but I kind of like this one. This song sounds familiar. Could have sworn I heard them in the last of us, but I think I actually heard her on earlier on in this game. I can't remember. Wow. We should totally throw a party in here. It's crazy, man. Everything left to this moment. Everything from Uncharted, Golden Abyss to this. Sam and Sully are coming to visit. You know what? Just for the occasion, I'll read this. We're sitting in a tiny cafe in the middle of a busy Havana street, drinking what might be the best goddamn espresso I've ever had in my life. No job, no one chasing his retirement is weird. Good, but weird. Sam tells him to stock up the fridge with less sh shitty beer before we arrive. His words, not mine. Sam's also reminding me that you lost the bet to both of us, 12 months and counting with no smoking. And I'm in Cuba for God's sake. That's how good I've been. Anyway, send the girls our love. Tell Cassie to warm up the back, back game and board. Yeah, I want my rematch. Looking forward to seeing the gang in a couple of weeks. Your pal, Victor. <laughs> Look at these two. So her name's Cassie. Don't know if it's Cassie Drake or what. Hey. <laughs> Off she goes. I don't remember us living in a house like this. Wait, hold on a second. This can't be the same place, is it? it looks similar on the inside. Ah, <sighs> perfect day. Man, this fucking game is just oh, awesome, man. Look at this through. freaking open area. Look at that water. Let's go over here. Vicky. <laughs> okay, girl. Where's mom and dad? 
All right, go find him. Go. Really? Fine, I'll find him myself. You know, I'll say this. This is like some Fast and Furious 6 type stuff right now. Living on the beach. Food's all here. Like the Fast Five ending. Think of that. That's what it's similar to, man. It's really reminiscent to those good times. Well, at least it's, the game has provided me with that. I said after everything, this game better have like a really warm, heartfelt ending. And I think it's, it's delivered on that note. And not here. He's looking for mom and dad, I guess. Okay, I guess I'll just wait then. What's in here? What do you keep in here? <laughs> so goofy. Treasure hunting runs in the family. I think it does. Hmm. He left his keys. He left his keys. Conveniently enough, yes, he left his keys. So what's in here? There's no Got a couple way. of ideas. There's just no way. She's a rebel. Whoa. Oh, I knew it. What is this? I don't know, you're Sam, cat. I mean, fuck. You're smart, Cassie. <laughs> Damn, my mind is lost right now. I've been playing for so long. St. Dismas Cross. What else we got in here? A Spanish doubloon. But from where? I don't know, you have to ask your father about that one. We gamers, we know where that's from. Don't we, guys? 16th century. Where is this from? Wow, so they must have kept that life hidden from her then. Got the Indiana Jones skull. Creepy. Kinda cool. Alright, what else we got in here? Oh, that's there too. Hello. It's her grandmother. Didn't we already read some of this, like, earlier on? Whoa. Henry Avery. The Gunsway Heist. Wait, did you go looking for Avery's treasure? Didn't go looking. They found Avery's treasure, if you must know. Yeah, I can only go straight. All right. There's a picture right there. No way. Is that dad? It's your dad and your uncle, Cassie. Parvis Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. Big things have small beginnings. That's what David from Prometheus said. Found this on my old camera. Thought you'd like to have it. E. I remember that. E. What the hell? Now I remember. Wasn't it late in the first game? Oh, shit. Hey, there you are. Hey. Been looking for you. What are you doing in here? Uh, looking for you guys. Come on, we loaded up the boat. It's ready. Cool. I'll catch up with you guys in a sec. Why? Uh, I 
I just need to, um... Uh, What's up, Cassie? Okay. Don't be mad. Hey, I said don't be mad. Keys. So, what did you see? Nothing really. Well, just that photo of you two and Sully. With a bunch of Spanish looking treasure. And a shotgun. Yeah. Huh. This is bound to happen sometime. Maybe we should just tell her. She's not ready for it. Ready for what? All that crazy shit in there? Language. Yeah, language. Sorry. But you guys are literally keeping skeletons in your closet. Or at least a silver skull of some kind. Mm. You know, I don't think I'm ready for this. Really? Me? It's time to have the talk. <laughs> yeah, it's totally time. Wait, which talk are we talking about here? She's just a kid. She's older than you and Sam when you started That's, all of that. That is different, and you know it. Okay, look, if you guys were into some shady stuff, it's totally cool. <laughs> but I think I'm old enough to know about it, right? Old enough? How old are you again? Ah, <laughs> funny. Mom? All right. Well, let's see. Um... For me, it started when this guy called me up with a scoop on a massive historical find. <laughs> it sounded like a complete fraud. Yeah, handsome fraud. No, I hadn't even met him yet. Well, she knew. <laughs> she knew. So this fraud says, if you fund the trip, then I'll give you the coffin of Sir Francis Drake. And for the record, I totally delivered. Yeah, he delivered us into the hands of Indonesian pirates. No, oh, come on, you know I had nothing to do okay, with that. Okay, guys, time out. You're saying that you were attacked by pirates after you found the coffin of Sir Francis Drake. Is that right? Yeah, yeah that, pretty that's pretty much right. it. Yeah. Bullshit. A language. language. Crap. Better. All right, so keep going. <laughs> you know what? The sun is up, boat's ready, wind is just right. You want to continue the story? I say we do it on the water. Come on. But well, wait, what would Francis Drake look like? Was it gross? Actually, he wasn't in there. Yeah, just his journal with a map to El Dorado. The city of gold? That's the legend. Turns out it was just a statue, a cursed statue. No way, seriously? Yeah, seriously. But uh, I'll get back to that. That was an awesome fucking game, guys. Like, that is the only words that I have to describe it. And I completely forgot that, yeah, I think you were in the Amazon in the first game. I know I said something about that before, but, uh, oh my god, this was such a good game, man. I'm so happy I played it. Uh, you know, this is what, in my opinion, gaming and games are all about. You know, I feel like I've grown as a gamer after playing a game of this magnitude. Like, it was just that good. It's one of the best games I've ever played on the PS4, especially. I mean, I only have, like, I have an entire row of Xbox One games on my shelf. But that's because that's where I started this generation. And I have two games, that being this, of course, and The Last of Us. But, you know, if, if it was only ever be two games to play on this generation for PS4, for me personally, I wouldn't have asked for any of the games except these two, you know. I'll always remember this game as one of the games that lay the foundation of what my channel is today. Uh, most of my predictions are right, you know, as I said, when you're a gamer, you kind of predict a lot of the stuff, what's going to go down, how it's going to happen. After you played it, it's like watching a horror movie, you know, it's, horror movies don't scare me that much because I know what's going to happen before it happens. 
Uh, this game started off slow, but then it kicked off and it hit hard, like Batman v Superman type hard. It was just, it was that good. It had one of the best Easter eggs, that being Crash, of course. Uh, I'm like I said, I'm just so happy I played it. It's hard to believe I almost didn't play it too, but I think I would have regretted that. I would have missed out on something spectacular. So. The music in this game was perfect. Might have to download some soundtrack songs. The only other game I did that with was Black Ops 2, the main theme. But, uh, yeah. I know I said I didn't want this game to end, but all good things must come to an end. And after all, the game says it's at these end. And, uh, yeah, Naughty Dog are the best. It was a pleasure playing this game for you guys. Please subscribe, drop a like, favorite this video, and stay tuned because we're not done with games on this channel. We got some more. Uh, I have been playing this since 12.45 a.m. It is 4.17 a.m. So, like I said, it was such a good game. I could play it for hours and hours on end. But that is it for Uncharted 4 at everyone. Thank you guys for watching. And see you guys on my next video.